So in terms of Starliner, uh, I would say a lot of testing is going on and a lot of modeling updates uh, all across the country. You know, we had a, a series of helium leaks that we dealt with during the CFT, the crude flight test. We have various materials and tests right now to improve that seal on the helium interface at the flange of the thruster. Uh, we know that we get some permeation of oxidizer vapor across and the, the seal that we had was not very robust for oxidizer exposure. So there's testing ongoing across the country to expose the, the new material that's proposed um, and understand how much we can permeation we can get. So that testing is ongoing, likely needing, leading to a new seal that will replace the seals in the, in the thruster flanges. And then on the, the thrusters that the software deselected because of low thrust, we have a series of tests uh, ongoing at the White Sands test facility in New Mexico. We have a thruster that we're taking and putting through pulse trains. In other words, um, small pulses and a certain frequency of those pulses larger pulses at a different frequency to understand how the thruster responds to those various pulses.